The Rothschild carriages were a popular display at Gunnersbury for many years and can still be seen today in our carriages gallery, which is adjoined to the cafe. People often ask me about the carriages, so for today's episode of Curator's Choice, I thought I would give you a sneak peek inside the town chariot. This carriage was used by the Rothschild family in the mid-1800s for ceremonial and business purposes and for the more important social events of an aristocratic and influential family. It was built by a company called Stamper and Sons of Wandsworth between 1830 and 1840. The design and the style of state carriages, like this one, were intended to reflect the wealth and importance of their owners, and so they were often impressive and heavily decorated. The town chariot is painted in the Rothschild family colours, which were blue and gold, and on the interior, shown here, is trimmed with blue silk damask and a silk and worsted lace. On the side of the carriage, the Rothschild arms are painted on the door panels with quarterings that represent the Rothschild's dual barony. The town chariot would have seated two passengers inside and they would have entered the carriage using these double folding steps, which closed inside the carriage doors. It would have been drawn by two horses. The coachman driving the carriage would have sat on the wide box seat at the front of the carriage and two footmen would have stood on a platform at the rear of the carriage holding on to the footman's holders, which were straps hanging from the back of the roof in order to keep themselves steady while the carriage was moving. Regular conservation cleaning of the carriage is really important to prevent any large build-ups of dust, but sometimes it can be tricky getting to those hard-to-reach areas 